Hi, this is Dan Kautz. And with this video I'm showing you my TAG CNC micro mill and how I use it to do uh, high speed milling uh, making what, what I have here is a medallion uh, actually carving in wax for uh, doing casting later on. I've already done the roughing pass so what you're seeing here is the finish pass using an engraving bit a very very small engraving bit. It's uh, 1 8 inch in diameter has a 10% taper and the tip is 0 .003 that's three thousandths of an inch at the tip extremely fine very small bit also very fragile if you don't know what an engraving bit is bit is it's basically a single edge cutter um, it looks like a, a needle with half of it cut away it's uh, like half of, half of a width one side is ground off and Right now you can see it running. It's, it's running at um, uh, 40 inches per minute. It probably could go faster, but this seems to work good in this particular uh, application. And it's running at 10,200 RPM. Very small bits have to go as fast as possible uh, to get uh, any worthwhile speed in cutting. There is air blowing on this piece to help uh, keep the dust away and it is a very fine dust that it makes even in wax those larger chips you see scattered are from the roughing cuts this whole process ran for three hours and 45 minutes and uh, you'll see at the end of the video the output of what this looks like as I back away you can see we're running at the uh, biggest diameter on the motor and the smallest on the uh, on the spindle head this is the z-axis you can see it's rapidly moving up and down uh, following the contours of the design. It's right now going through some lettering so it jumps up and down to, to form the various letters. It does a very nice job with that very micro sized uh, mowing bit that's in there. Now, no video would be complete of CNC without showing the controls there. The bottom <coughs> underneath the shelf there is my power supply and controller. It also has a smooth stepper installed inside of it for Mach 3. On the top of the bench there was the computer. And of course here's the computer screen. You can't have a video without showing the Mach 3 screen. Rapidly changing numbers there. When you scroll a little bit to the left here you'll see the, the numbers scrolling by quite rapidly. You look real close at the screen. You can see that the uh, uh, passes there are 72,000, almost 72,700 lines of code, and we've been running for 55 minutes, which looks to be less than a third there of the surface machine so far. Here's the finished piece, and you can see the detail of the carving. 